Hello everyone, this is Mystic Goddess with your general reading. So today we're going to tap into how your ex truly feels about you currently and what they want you to know. This reading is for everyone of every zodiac sign, so feel free to switch the energies around as needed. All right, so I've meditated over the energy and I've shoveled the deck, so let's go ahead and get started. The overall energy of what your ex wants you to know is how could you still love me after all I've done, okay? So for a lot of you, your ex is wondering if you still love them. And for some of you, they're wondering how could you even still have love for them after all that they put you through. The Six of Swords is clarifying this energy. So it lets me know that this person, they know that they took you on a ride. They put you through a lot, especially emotionally. And for some of you, I feel as though this person they know that they should have treated you better, okay? There may have been some hurt, some hurtful words spoken, okay? Regardless, this person took you through a very emotional journey, okay? I also feel as though um, when it comes to your ex, they may have been a juggler or juggling you and someone else, okay? They're also wishing that they would have made better choices when it comes to you, they're um, unsure about how they feel about you being single from them, okay? They still have a lot of love for you. And for some of you, they don't want you to express your love to anyone else or they don't want you to have love for anyone else. I feel as though your ex, um, there's still a very strong connection here with the King of Cups, okay? They're starting to see things differently now and they're realizing what they did wrong in this connection. I feel as though this person is starting to um, see that they weren't giving you what it is that you deserve. They're also realizing that they should have offered you more in this connection. For some of you, um, your ex have, may have made you feel as though um, they were interested in others or that they weren't focusing on you. For some of you, they even tried to make you feel as though you weren't enough, when in reality, they knew that you were the empress all along. This person is aware that they won't meet anyone else like you, and they also feel as though they're facing judgment for the way that they treated you. So this person may feel as though... Um, like judgment from God has been cast upon them for the decisions that they made in regards to you. It's like they didn't want you to know your worth. Okay. For some of you, um, they have some things that they want to say to you, but they don't know how to say it. This person also wants you to be stuck single. They don't want you to deal with anyone else or get in a happy relationship with anyone but they've been watching you okay i also feel as though they're not as stable financially as they would like to be they're having problems paying their bills they feel as though things are completely over and you're starting a new cycle and they're watching it ever since you ended things with them or they ended things with you they've been watching you okay for some of you they do want to come back together with you okay they feel as though the two of you will get back together. For some of you, they do want to spend time with you, okay? But yeah, this person, they may have been a player or someone that was just very inconsistent. And like I said, they feel like they're facing judgment for doing that, for playing around with you, being inconsistent, being very in and out. For some of you, this person was very promiscuous. They dealt with a lot of different people because the Knight of Wands is here along with the Three of Cups. So th there was definitely a third party here, whether you knew about the third party or not. They have a lot of things they want to say to you, okay? A lot of emotional things, but they're afraid to express how they feel. For some of you, they're worried that they may not be able to get a new opportunity with you. The tower is here with the Ace of Pentacles, so that also lets me know that this person literally feels as though they messed up a blessing, okay? Because the Ace of Pentacles is a blessing from God. So they feel as though they destroyed the blessing that God gave to them, okay? Hmm. Their life is a disaster right now. They may have lost a home, a vehicle, a job, money. There's some resources that they lost. Okay. They're also um 
the things that they're going through these hardships these losses they may not be letting people know they're trying to keep it a secret but yeah they're wondering how you could still love them after all that they've done to you or if you even still love them at all because they they took you down through there this is someone that that took you on a very emotional journey things were very rocky between the two of you they knew that you deserved better than them okay they know that they should have treated you better so we're going to see what else comes out, okay? Let's get more messages in regards to um, your ex. So Holy Spirit, give me more messages in regards to how this ex truly feels or what this ex wants my viewers to know currently. What does that ex want them to know currently? Two more shuffles. Okay, so let's see what else comes out. So this person did a lot. They left they did a lot and they just left you to deal with the emotions behind all that they put you through. Some of you left this person, for others they left you, okay? But they're hoping that the two of you will come back together. At the bottom of the deck, I'm reminded of you constantly. So this person thinks about you a lot, okay? I feel as though they may hear songs that remind them of you. Okay, give me more. What else? Thank you. I'm in a much better headspace now. So for some of you, this ex is admitting that they were messed up in the head. Okay? They were messed up in the head. They also feel as though something is missing in their life and they're trying to figure out what that is. And I feel as though for a lot of you, your ex has a lot of toxic traits because they need some inner healing. They may have childhood issues that have not been resolved, but that's no excuse here. Give me more in regards to what this ex wants everyone to know. Look, no other compares to you. Thank you, spirit. Didn't I tell you guys? Then I tell you that they feel as though they'll never find anyone else like you. So they're stating that no other compares to you, okay? At the bottom of the deck, I know you're right, but I need to come to my own conclusion. So for a lot of you, you may have even told this person that they weren't going to meet anyone else like you or, you know, something of that nature. That they weren't going to find anyone that's as good to them as you were. This car always reminds me of the Empress, whether you're a male or female. The Empress and the Emperor, because no one compares to the Empress, compares to the Empress and the Emperor, right? Okay, so give me more messages. What else does this ex want my viewers to know? Thank you. So we have, I miss you regardless of how things seem. So this ex misses you a lot. Like I said, um, they're, they come off as very cold. Um... Even though, um, even though they miss you, they try to make it seem as though they don't. At the bottom of the deck, we have, please don't take what happened personally. It's not you, it's me. So this person is admitting that they have a problem. Give me more. There's nothing you could have done to um, make things better. Or there's nothing you could have done better in the connection. I'm not stating that you were perfect. Everyone makes mistakes. Everyone messes up. You know, we're we're all flawed to some extent. But I feel like you did try to make things work. Okay. I just have something else to do right now. Please try and understand. So for some of you, this person is preoccupied. They may be busy with work. For some of you, it may be someone else. But regardless, if they are with someone else, they're reminded of you constantly. I feel badly for the way that I treated you. You didn't deserve that. So they're admitting you didn't deserve the way that they did you. Okay. Also, this card um, always comes out when someone's planning on returning. So this person, they don't feel like it's over between the two of you, regardless of how things ended. Give me more. What else? Thank you. I know you're right, but I need to come to my own conclusion. So again, this person is stating that you were right. Whatever you told them, you were right about it. Um... They think a lot about whatever it is that you said to them. We also have you've been in my dreams. So this person daydreams about you or they may actually have dreams of you. Give me one more card. Holy Spirit. Thank you. Look at this. I still love you. Wow. And that came out crossing. So for some of you, um, they didn't act like they loved you. Okay. 
that card came out on top of no one no other compares to you so they're stating that they still love you i feel like they'll always have love for you and anyone else that they connect with reminds them of you because it's not the same they can't find you in anyone else okay so they should have treated you better when they had you so let's pull another card from the tarot i am using the tazama african tarot this is a beautiful deck guys i love the energy of this deck i will put a link to this deck in the description box below so let's get some more messages before we end the reading so give me more messages in regards to this ex what does this ex want my viewers to know? What does their ex want them to know? Two more shuffles. So yeah, you can't be replaced. And they know that. But this person, they tried to make, make you um, feel less than in some way, shape, or form. They didn't want you to know your worth, but they knew your worth all along. They were just hoping that you didn't. At the bottom of the deck is the emperor. So, wow. When it comes to your ex, okay? For some of you, you may have been married to this person. For others of you, I feel as though when it comes to your ex, they may have had control issues. And they're stating that they were controlling. For those of you, if your ex was controlling or very stubborn, it was because of your beauty or, or your, um, well, whether you're a male or a female, it was because of your aura and also your physical attribute attributes, okay? I feel like there was jealousy here as well. For some of you... Um, there was definitely someone else. The Queen of Wands in a general reading is known as the, the other woman or the other man. Okay. So they're also stating that they've gotten their heart broken. So if they were cheating on you with someone else, they ended up getting cheated on. They may even break up. Okay. Because the Four of Wands is right beside it. They're also stating they should have held on to you. They should have held on to this relationship instead of letting it go. Okay. Uh, but yeah, again, it's still showing that even though they left or you left them, okay, they're stating that they've been watching you ever since the, this ending between the two of you. They're also stating that they feel like a fool for thinking that there were plenty of fish in the sea. Okay. Wow. So yeah. Um, when it comes to them, for some of you, they may have been dealing with someone else at their job or something like that, but they're stating that whatever the two of you went through or whatever this other person put them through, it made them more serious about you. It made them feel as though you are their divine masculine or their divine feminine. Okay. Wow. So that's deep very deep give me one more card to end this reading holy spirit when it comes to this x look judgment is here and right beside judgments we have the page of wands so some of you told this person like you're gonna reap what you sow and they're saying that they did for some of you there's something that you said that came to fruition for this person they're also stating that they should have made better decisions for some of you they may have talked to you very reckless or something of that nature okay but they're stating they feel foolish for letting you go for a lot of you they want a new cycle with you this has definitely affected them on a huge level this breakup even though they try to act like it didn't all right, so that is the reading, everyone. If you guys resonated with this or if you liked this reading, make sure that you give this video a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. I would love to have you as a part of the Mystic family. I love each and every one of you guys so, so much. You take care. Be safe. Until next time, bye.